Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. It's Amy here and today we are doing a our very first Stampin' Up! catalog walkthrough. So what you see right here is the May 2024 through April 2025 idea book. It is good for a whole year. So their year starts May 1 and ends on April 30th of the following year. So it is big. It is uh, over 140 pages. I am going to thumb through it rather quickly with you now. And keep in mind that you can view this on um, my Stampin' Up! website, which will go live tomorrow morning. And that website, I will put it in the description box, but my Stampin' Up! website is amymcgrew.stampinup.com. Net. So when we open up, we have a nice letter from Shelly and Sarah, who are the founder and the CEO of Stampin' Up. And then this idea book is a lot different than a Close to My Heart idea book. It, um, it, it is um, divided into step-by-step -step crafting, quick and easy options, and then creativity your way, which is when you like to for lack of a better term, kind of create from scratch. So we're doing box brownie mix over here and brownies from scratch over here. And there is an index at the end. I also want you to keep in mind that all of this is available uh, to view online on my website, as well as a plethora of more product as well. So when we walk through this, they're showing us that they do have kits and I can tell you that every month they release two new exclusive kits that they release online only. Um, I am super excited about Paper Pumpkin. If you are familiar with the Craft With Heart scrapbooking and the Craft With Heart card making subscription box, Paper Pumpkin is like the card subscription box. And I am really excited about this. And I'm excited that um, all of you who were subscribers to Craft With Heart now have this to sub subscribe to. So it comes in a cute little box. You'll get a box every month. I don't have a lot of product, but the product I have, I will show you. So then it just shows you that you get to um, create these cards in three simple steps. You open up the box and there is a little brochure, an instructional brochure. And this particular kit was from last December. So it's not available anymore, but they sent me this with my kit. And you'll see the paper pumpkin kit that is available online. Um, and then they show you everything you get in the kit. And then they give you ideas of how you can do different things with it. And then you open up the brochure and it shows you the three cards that the kit will walk you through. So it would help if I was on camera. So we've got this card, this card, and this card. And then they give you step-by-step -step, um, diagrams. So you can see there's step one for this card, step two, step three, and step four. And that's how, so it's just pictures. You don't even have to know how to read to show that. I apologize, I'm not getting all of that in the camera. But let me show you what is in the content. So you do get an exclusive stamp set, just like we did in Craft With Heart. You get some tear tape. This is adhesive, um, and we call it tear tape because you can actually just tear it with your fingers. It's like a double-sided tape. So you do get adhesive in with your kit. You get a Stampin' Spot, which is a little three by three, or not three by three, one by one cube of ink. And this one is called Pebbled Path. And then you get some uh, embellishments. So these are um, adhesive back little gems. And then what's neat about this is I love how it's packaged. So let me move that out of the way. So you've got 
three each of three different card bases. And then you've got th these, um, this goes for this particular card is actually part of the card that I think goes on top, but you've got that gold foiling. So then here are three more of those card bases. And then for this card, these punch outs go with this. And again, you'll be able to see from that brochure, um, so um, for this particular one, you're getting those. So these are kind of out of order, I guess. So with these, with this particular card base, you see you're getting that gold circle cut out. Um, and then for this particular one, you're getting these punch outs and then check out this card look how pretty that is so for that one that's where we're using these so this is going to go right on top like that and then you're using the this punch out that goes on top of that um, but an idea that i had is you could also cut these in half and then mat one on a standard size card and mat the other on a standard size card. And then rather than nine cards, you can make 18 cards. You can also use these as photo mats or as enhancements on your scrapbooking. But then, you know I love colored envelopes and look at the pretty envelopes that we get with this paper pumpkin. So again, this one is no longer available, but this is a tasting of what you'll be able to get. Now, the other thing I read is you can buy extra add-ons to a kit. So if you're wanting more bases or envelopes, you'll be able to order more of that and you won't have to have a whole other box because you don't need more than one stamp set. Um, here are the the punch out. So when you see all those flowers, um, that's what these are. And they punch out very easily. So you get several sheets of that. And then here is um, the, this is a belly band. So the another nice feature of this is you get a clear box that you just fold this up. And I love these boxes. I've actually purchased these before. So it just folds up, all your cards will fit in there. And then this little belly band goes right over it. and it's already pre-scored and everything. So that is a really cool thing. I'm really excited about this. So if you are wanting to do, I know they come out with, um, with um, Christmas ones, you can um, get, that's how you can do your Christmas cards. And then everything fits in your box. So I'm super excited about that. So Paper Pumpkin is a subscription that you can get. And it will come to your mailbox every month. And there is in the catalog a QR code where you can scan that and see much more about this. And it's $25 per month, free gifts and access to exclusive products for subscribers. And you can join. So I hope you all will join me in that. Okay, so then we have the quick and easy options. And this is really fun because, well, here's a, a listing of the top 10 crafting essentials, scissors and inks and adhesives and blocks and all that kind of thing. But then you turn to this page and it's called Mix and Match. And for those of you who love quick and easy cards, you will like this. Um, I do have this to show you what it is is matching pre-printed card bases and envelopes and there's two different ones to choose from 
So I will show you the one of the ones. I got both of them and it's called Sunny Springs Cards and Envelopes. So it's this one. I got both of them because I thought that one would be good for more masculine cards. So you get pre-printed card bases. And again, it's printed on both sides so you can cut it in half and make two cards. But I love these patterns especially for this time of year. But then check out the envelopes. They're decorated on the front side, but then you turn them over, and I don't even think the camera's doing justice. Turn them over, and they're decorated on the back and then the insides. And you all know how much I love envelope liners. So these are gonna be great to add your stamp images to, stickers, other papers. But then they also had a, have ephemera packs. So I did get one ephemera pack, and this is just like um, the die cuts, again, in our Cut Above kits. So you get two sheets of each one, and they just punch out. And then you can use these on your cards. So you can see here how they've used them on the cards. And again, they'll be great embellishments for scrapbook pages and tags and all the things. So there's two sheets of each. And the pack that I got was something for everyone. I love the pink camera. I love the suitcases. Love the bow. Um, but you can see there's all kinds of everything. There's even a cowboy. <laughs> I love the lemons. Lemons are really big right now. We've got balloons and rainbows and banners and hearts. So you get two sheets of these. And again, check out the ice cream. You can use these for so many other things as well. So I only got one pack in my kit, but I do like there's a, um, say something where it's all different words and different fonts and colors. There's a flowering one, which is all flowers, and then there's a labels and layers. So you could combine all of these, which is what they did on these samples over here. Here are some of the words. There's some of the labels, the flowers, and the something for everyone. So you can mix and match. And then, of course, here is a stamped sentiment. This is a great beginner set because it's got something for celebrating birthdays, just celebrating, thank you, hello, just a note, miss you, thank you. So that would be a great one to have. The other thing I want you to keep in mind when you're looking through this is um, Stampin' Up! has two different types of stamps. They have the polymer stamps, which is just like the, the close to my heart acrylic stamps. Let me pull this out for you. So this is polymer stamps. But then they also have what's called cling stamps. And the cling stamps come on a sheet like this, but it's red rubber. It's like the, the image that you would find on a block stamp, rubber stamp that we used to have years and years ago. So you can't see through it. So when you are looking through the idea book, make sure that you read the fine print because some are polymer stamps and some are cling stamps. So this one says right here, 10 polymer stamps. So that would be a clear stamp. So then you can see here are more examples of how you can use those card bases mixed with the ephemera packs and that stamp set. So great ideas. I, I like to call this catalog an idea book as well. Um, so then they're just teaching you about color. Down here is a really great resource because it gives you card pattern ideas, card design ideas. So that's a great resource to have. You can look at that if you're trying to come up with some card ideas. And so then we've got more stamps here. So here it says, choose happy. And in the fine print, it does says polymer stamps. And this one is polymer stamps. And again, these are great um, all occasion, like every day, I like to call these generic um, neutral stamps. These are neutral because they go with everything and lots of ideas. So then, um, as you may know, Stampin' Up! is not really heavy into memory keeping, but they are getting very heavy into memory keeping. You're going to see come fall, 
some kits that are going to look very similar to our close to my heart kits with 12 by 12 scrapbooking but they do have a really fun six by eight program so you can see this is the album they do have divided page protectors and then they have what's called memory plus which is kind of like our picture my life cards and i have a pack here and these actually uh, feature some brand new colors from uh, Stampin' Up. So you've got the three by four cards and they are different on both sides, which is really fun. And you know, if you know me, you know I love to use these in my scrapbooks as well. I make cards with them. They're not just for um, pocket scrapbooking, but they are great for pocket scrapbooking. So all different kinds. I won't go through all of them, but that is what um, Stampin' Up! calls it Memories Plus. So that is a fun thing. And then um, you're getting into um, collections. So a stamp set and paper collection. Now this down here says clean stamps. So this is a set that would be red rubber that you would then cling to your block. Okay, so now we're getting into creativity your way, which is a little bit more um, a step above the quick and easy. And so these are their different suites. So we have the Mediterranean blooms. And when you read down here, you'll be able to see that you can purchase things a la carte or you can purchase the whole sweet collection and you get a little bit of a discount when you do that. So you'll see the pattern papers and these are 12 by 12. Another thing I want you to really pay close attention to is reading what size the papers are. So they call their pattern paper designer series paper or DSP and um, you can read and you can find out how many sheets are in their pack their paper packs and what size they are because they do vary this is 12 by 12 there's a stamp set there's coordinating dies there's embellishments and then you can see pretty artwork so everything's available a la carte or you can get it in a bundle and save a little bit Another collection is called Take to the Sky. And again, I am going through this very quickly, just as a quick walkthrough to give you a taste. You can spend time on my website looking at it all. And when you make, um, if, you're, if you had a Close to My Heart VIP customer membership, Stampin' Up! knows who those people are and they will send a free catalog to those who had that membership. You can also purchase a catalog along with your, um, your order. So this, 